Once a year, the Arabian desert hosts one of the world's most unique beauty pageants. People travel thousands of miles to attend, but you won't find any catwalks, designer dresses or makeup artists, because here, they're on the lookout for the Gulf's next top camel. Thousands of participants strut their stuff in two prestigious competitions, one for the light-coloured Asayil breed, another for the dark-skinned Mejahim. And in the world of camel beauty pageants, big is most definitely beautiful. There's a very specific criteria followed when judging a camel's beauty. The size of its head, the length of its back, but also the shape of its hump are all incredibly important. And here at the DEFRA Festival, the very best of the best can be expected to sell for around two million pounds. Contestants are decked out in the finest fashions, but looks aren't everything, and extra points are awarded for model behavior. Khamis Mohammed Al Shari is a camel owner who's been attending these events for years. He knows what it takes to pick a winner. There is a special committee appointed by the authorities which judges the competition, and they place all the camels together in one pen and decide who's best. And today, thank God, we took first place. The Al Defra festival is billed as a celebration of Emirati tradition and is attended by people from across the Gulf, but it's also attracting many from further afield. You know, as we arrived, we, we were ushered in and we were given a personal guide, tried some amazing Arabian coffee and then taken around to the stalls and exactly explained what they're looking for. You know, the, the length of the neck, the, um, the, the hair, just everything, the eyelashes, the lips. It's been quite fascinating to think it's another whole um, interest, a passion people have. Once a winner is announced, it's time to celebrate. With millions of pounds worth of prizes and national pride at stake, here, beauty really is in the eye of the beholder. Zain Jafar, Sky News, in the western region of the United Arab Emirates.